90 minutes southwest of Townsville, Charters Towers was Queensland's second largest city 100 years ago. And it's still a hub today. At the Aussie Outback Oasis, it takes no time to get the Jayco Expander parked and set up. OK, what are you doing there? Well, I'm just having a look at what we can do today. And there's this place where they have longhorn cattle and we can do a wagon ride. I reckon oh. Baxter, you think that's really cool? Yeah, absolutely. Yep. Beauty, beauty. Oh, there he is in the, on the jumping pillow. Come on, we're going to go on a wagon ride. We're off to Horseshoe Bee Longhorns, which is run by Michael and Linda Bethel, just 15 minutes from the centre of town. Oh, on the wagon. Thanks for coming to say hello to this little guy. There. Hello. hello. <laughs> hey, guys. Murray. Yeah, Michael Murray. Hi, Michael, Michael. How are you going? Oh, Linda's like mate? a game of tennis, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to ring the dinner bell, mate? Yes. Yeah. Over town. Oh, look at that. Ooh, oh, yeah. So whose idea was it to, um, to do the longhorns? We started breeding longhorns about 15 years ago. Then about three years ago, we just decided to see if anyone was interested in coming to have a look at the longhorns. And it's just amazing. I mean, people come all around the country, overseas, to have a look at the Texas longhorns. Right here for you, Baxter. Before we head out on that wagon ride, you'll be a real cowboy now. <laughs> See, what you don't know about me okay. is I actually have a great passion for horses in you. Fair Ingham. Yeah, well, I've got a veggie garden. Good scoop, Nick. Good scoop. Well done, Good well girl. Done. Where should I put it? Good girl. Oh, I just rode the fence, Nicky, and then come back get another one. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Four wheel drive. <laughs> just over to your left here. Rightio, you have a look over here, you'll see uh, that's JR. That's the. Not <laughs> his horns that. There, there, he's a fellow with the horns that are nine feet from tip to tip. So is that Baxi? Nine the big, foot. The big long horns? And he's the longest horned beast in Australia. Right, isn't it? Yeah. So how long does it take them to fully grow their horns? Um, the steer's horns just keep growing all the time. The cows and the bulls kind of stop after about, what, 10 years or so. And so, Linda, is there a pecking order amongst them? There is, actually. This fellow's the king of them all out here. It's the size and the attitude of the beast. Whoa! Here comes Mother. Well, welcome to Bethel Saddlery, wow. people. There's one I'm working on right now built on what we call a wade tree. That's your traditional western wade saddle. So um, probably as cowboys it gets Murray. Yeah, right. So Michael, how long would this take to make? Uh, this saddle, you can normally make a, just a plain saddle in about five days. Mm. So it just depends on how elaborate. And so this is the start? That's the start. That's what we call the, the saddle tree. What's that so made out of? Made out of it's, cu it's made out of wood. This is uh, really? a pine covered with rawhide. You can get all your strength out of the rawhide. So it just sat as hard and as strong as iron. Oh. That's the old ancient way of making saddle trees. And it's, it's proved itself over and over again for hundreds of years. Mm. 